Hey everyone, my name is Minus10 and I'm a middle-aged gamer and tech enthusiast that enjoys all gadgetry related to gaming, streaming, and content creation. So today I'm going to unbox the Anchor Gallium Nitride 737 charger that delivers 120 watts through two USB type C ports and one USB type A port. So uh, you may be asking yourself, why is he unboxing a charger when he covers gaming and streaming content? Uh, good question. Um, the reason I'm covering this unboxing is because for the past few years, I've been using the 65 watt version of this product. And I mean, it's an absolutely impressive uh, product and Anchor is able to deliver a lot of power through a very small form factor. And when you're traveling, you know, weight is always something to consider. For work and personal reasons, you know, I travel quite a bit and this 65 watt charger has been an absolute workhorse. So usually when I reach my destination, I go through a normal process where I'll unpack my bag and then almost immediately uh, plug in my iPad. You know, as the evening wears on, I'm getting ready for bed, I'll then plug in usually my iPhone and Apple Watch. So, you know, for for these three devices, you know, 65 watts, it's it's about right. Uh, but, you know, throw in a camera or let's say I want to use my uh, MacBook Pro. Uh, yeah, it's, it's not going to have enough juice. So finally, I decided I'm going to add some more charging juice to my travel kit. And I bought the Gallium uh, Nitrate 737 charger from Anchor and should add an additional watts to my uh, total capacity so uh, let's uh, let's see what's in the box and uh, see what it looks like so this is the box here get it on camera that's what it looks like the back pretty straightforward charger so let's uh, cut it open Right, nothing too glamorous, <laughs> just a charger. Comes in this little sleeve. So that's not gonna. Oh, it's got definitely uh, some extra weight to it here. Not sure if that'll come through on the camera. Anchor. So, yeah, pretty pretty chunky device. Now let's set this to the side here. Now I'll bring in the 65 watt charger and you can see um, that uh, the 150 watt charger is definitely uh, a little bit chunkier than the, the 65 watt charger. Uh, it's not double the size, uh, but it definitely is bigger. I'll raise it up here. So this is roughly two and a half inches in length and this is roughly okay so it's about an inch longer and it's about an inch and a half wide and it's probably a quarter inch quarter inch uh, wider height wise it's it's marginally higher all right let's bring in the scale and uh, see what these uh, devices come in at on weight here. Okay, and I'm using, uh, I'm in the US, so I'm using pounds. So let's start off with the 65 watt charger. Let's zero that out. And that is roughly four and a half ounces. And in grams, 129 grams. Okay, so four, six ounces. And this, the, the 737 gallium nitride is uh, 7.1 ounces. And uh, uh, an absolutely even 200 grams. So uh, definitely a bit more girth uh, to uh, this, this 165 watt charger. So now, uh, Yes, I am an Apple fanboy, so let's uh, 
Let's bring in the, uh, this is for the MacBook Pro 14 2023 model. Uh, you know, a very solid device. You know, Apple is always making high quality products. Problem is, is when you connect this very heavy charger into an outlet, if the outlet doesn't have a lot of grip, it sometimes just sort of, you know, falls out. So, uh, but it's, uh, you know, tried and true charger. It's got an additional extra port there. But let's see how much this weighs in ounces. Here we go. So, yeah, so this, this is the heaviest of the three. It's at 10.4 ounces. And in grams, that is just about 30 grams. And I believe this, this charger packs 100. I can't remember what this charger uh, amount is, but I'll have to... I'll have to look it up online, but um, yeah, so those are, that's it. So I'm going to ditch the Apple charger and I am going to instead uh, travel with the two anchor products. So I'll have 150 watts for the, for the big guy here uh, and that should be able to drive my MacBook Pro, uh, iPad, battery chargers, and then for the other devices like the iPhone and Apple Watch, I'll use the 65 watt charger. So now in... In, in regards to pricing, uh, as of August 2023, it appears the Anchor 737 can be purchased for around $110. Uh, pretty confident this will be a good purchase. And if you're on the go with lots of battery needs, uh, could be a good addition to your travel kit. Thanks for watching. And if you enjoyed this content, I'd appreciate it if you would hit the like button and subscribe to receive future notifications.